Well, I'll do my best. All done. Huh? Seriously? Huh? I'm Keiji Sato, just your average office worker working in sales. I was gearing up for work, but, but I need to see you step up your game. Well, I'll do my best. <laughs> Mr. Kobayashi, that's a bit too harsh. Yeah, seriously. Take a look at the overall sales department's performance. It's on the rise, right? What the hell are you guys even saying? And then. Excuse me, is Keiji Sato here? Whoa, that scared me. Huh? What's going on? What in the world is happening? I'm from the information systems department. Which one of you is Keiji? Um, that'll be me. Wow, she's stunning. We are dealing with a system failure and struggling. Can you please help? A system failure? Can you tell me more about this situation? Can't use email, browser, or scheduler. Can't even access folders on the company server. Exactly, and because of that, we're flooded with inquiries in the IS department. But we can't figure out the cause. Please come to the IS department right away and help us. Got it. Let's go. Hey, hey! Don't just go off on your own. I'm not done talking yet. Who told you about me? It was Miss Suzuki from our department. None of our team could solve the situation this time, so she has to call you right away. I see. Hey! Huh? You came along? We only need Keiichi. <sighs> you. I'm in a hurry. Anyways, do you know why your sales performance isn't good? But I heard he's an excellent person, you know. Oh, Keiichi's here. Now I'm relieved. Long time no see, Miss Suzuki. Sorry for calling you out of the blue. No worries. So about the current situation, can you show me the system configuration diagram? Here you go. Thank you. So, um. Anyways, you're just goofing off when you entertain clients, aren't you? Huh? You're still here? No, definitely not. Um, could you check the situation on that PC over there? Sure. Hmm. Still no luck. I see. Hmm. Well then, I'll. He doesn't need to say such harsh things right now. So, dealing with a system failure now. This isn't the time for it. You need to focus on your actual job right now. All right then. All done. Huh? Seriously? Huh? Whoa, it's back up. You managed to fix such a serious system failure in such a short time? That's amazing. What's going on? It's fixed. Amazing. With all those other experts unable to fix it, yet he did it all by himself. Is this for real? As expected of you. Thank you. Wow, that's really incredible. I really respect you. <laughs> no problem. So about the cause of the system failure. Uh huh. Just to make sure it doesn't go back to how it was, I've added patch programs to the weak spots in the system. You did all that in this short amount of time? <laughs> Perfect. Cage is awesome, right? Well then, I'll take my leave. Cage, you really saved us. That was really impressive. I was so surprised. Thank you so much. Our company's hero. You saved us. <clears throat> Can't stand all the attention he's getting. It's really bugging me. Phew, that was close. Yeah, no kidding. We had no idea what was gonna happen there for a sec. Um, about Keiichi. Who <laughs> he really is, right? Yes. He used to be in the IS department before transferring to sales. So that's how you know him, and he's knowledgeable about the systems, huh? That's one thing. But what's crazy about him is, he's got this amazing IT background, and at his age, he's got all these qualifications. That's incredible. 
But if Keiichi is such an extraordinary person, why did the sales department boss give him such a low rating? The next day. Hey, folks from the sales department. Good job. Thanks, boss. Thanks, Thanks boss. Hmm. Sato, about the system glitch yesterday. I heard you stepped in and fixed it when no one else could. Yes. If it weren't for you, the whole company would have been screwed. Thank you for coming to rescue. I really appreciate it. No problem. So, it's a good opportunity. How about heading back to the IS department? What do you think? Yeah, I'll do that. Thanks for letting me indulge in sales for a while. It's been a really useful experience being at the front of the company, and I can use that in system design. Hey, I wonder if we can manage without him. It might not be as easy to handle sales without him anymore. <laughs> Perfect. Even though he's getting all the praise now. Is that okay with the sales department? Of course. I think it's a brilliant idea. Sato seems more suited for the IS department. It's a matter of the right person for the right job, you know. As for sales, well, let's just say it might not be his fort. Mr. Kobayashi, are you sure we'll be right without him? We'll be just fine. Trust me. You do know Sato's been struggling with his sales figures, right? But. Hmm. A while later, in the sales department. Hey, hey, hey! So why the heck are our sales figures dropping even though Sato left? Well, it's because Keiichi. Everyone's sales numbers are dropping on their own, you know. What's the deal with everyone's sales performance dropping when Sato left? Because without Keiichi. Ah, jeez! What the hell is going on? Ever since Keiichi left. We've had to deal with various arrangements. When he was around, there were a few arrangements to deal with, making sales a breeze, you know. He played a big part of the role. <sighs> What's up with the idea that having Sato around will make sales arrangements easier? Seriously, why is everyone giving Sato so much credit? He's not even in the sales department anymore, yet they keep talking about him. Ah, <sighs> that sucks. Ugh, that really ticked me off. I'll give him a piece of my mind. Just came to check up on you. So how's it going, Mr. Kobayashi? Looks like you're really thriving in your work. That's a good thing. You had a tough time with sales performance back then, huh? Who is that guy? What's he talking about? <laughs> Looks like I'm drawing attention. Could you just quit it with the baseless remarks? What on earth are you doing here? Ever since Sato left the sales department, our sales performance has been dropping. Isn't that strange, right? That's absolutely baseless. You're not making any sense. Please stop bothering me. I've only just started working here, but I've seen his work ethic up close. I don't think he's the type to pull something like that. But that's just your personal opinion, right? Continuing this conversation is pointless. Take a good look at the sales performance and analyze the root cause. Have a solid chat with the staff as well. I'm sure you'll figure it out. <laughs> Bringing up logic to change the subject ain't gonna fly. Oh, Mr. Kobayashi, what are you doing here? Someone from the IS department told us you were here. Seriously, it's embarrassing. Please stop. I was just checking in on Sato because I was worried about him. What are you talking about? Huh? You really don't know how much he was contributing to the sales department, do you? Huh? He didn't do anything, did he? No, no, no. He regularly communicated with clients. Do you understand what that means? Huh? Communication, you say? Like making calls, having meetings, whining and dining, right? I get that well enough. Good, but what's important is how that affects things afterwards, you know? Even if you didn't close deals during those meetings or dinners, keeping in touch with clients helps build trust. That's crucial. 
If you gain their trust, you understand how it makes sales easier, right? Keiichi handed over these kinds of clients to me and Takahashi. And that's how our sales performance improved. In many cases, we could close deals almost effortlessly. It made sales very easy. I can't thank him enough. <sighs> so does that mean Sato's performance was low? Because he handed over the contract's case to other staff? I was more concerned about the overall performance of the sales department. If it improved peacefully, that was fine by me. Peacefully? He could have excelled individually. But he chose not to, you know? Yeah. I just didn't want other employees to lose motivation. Or start feeling jealous. It could have caused some serious trouble, you know? So, Keiji was thinking about the entire sales department. Isn't that what a leader of the sales department should do? Make it easier for everyone to sell? <sighs> Basically, you didn't even notice Keiji's efforts in supporting the sales team. You just kind of looked down on him. You should have got it if you'd listened properly. Plus, Keiji has an incredible background in qualifications. He graduated from a prestigious university with a degree in information engineering, and during his time there, he passed two difficult exams, the IT strategist examination and the project manager examination. He's recognized objectively as a highly skilled information processing technician. So basically the opposite of what you're saying. He's amazing at both sales and IT. That's the real Keiichi for you. Damn it. There's not a single thing I could beat him at. But, but, huh, that's just lucky breaks. It's all just luck. If I really put my mind to it, I could easily improve our sales performance. Nonsense. All right then, Kobayashi. Let's see what you've got. Boss? I came here to check on Sato after his move. But what's with all the fuss? So... Of course I heard everything. Kobayashi, it's not good to drag down your co-workers. Especially exceptional employees like Sato are really valuable to the company. Yet you... So since Sato left, the sales department's performance has gone downhill. I need you to step up your game right away. Get the performance back to... Where I can trust you to handle the sales department without any concerns. Can you handle it? Y yes Besides just the regular employees, bosses can pitch in with sales too. It's all about building trust with clients as a company. If our company can gain trust across the board, it'll make sales a whole lot easier for everyone. And since it impacts overall performance, there's a great opportunity for you to showcase your skills, Mr. Kobayashi. Feel free to show off your skills to the fullest. My abilities? Skills? What should I do? I don't even know what to do from now on. Just watch me. He's turned pale. I wonder what he's going to do. After that, Mr. Kobayashi just freaked out and couldn't boost the sales. Then he started giving unauthorized discounts. When they found out, he got his pay slashed, got demoted, and got sued for damages. Couldn't take it anymore, so he quit. Now, he's struggling dealing with money issues. As for me... Thank you for always teaching me about IT. You're such an eager learner. It's really satisfying to teach you. You know, not just at work, but... I'd love for you to come over and teach me even more. Huh? Come to her place? Is that okay? After my time in the sales department, I might have gained the trust of a gorgeous co-worker. Maybe. Just maybe. Thanks for watching till the end. Please subscribe to our channel too.